Hello everybody. You're thinking about selling your house during the holidays. Is that the best time of year to secure the most amount of money? Well, that's the topic of my next video. Hello everybody. Are you thinking about selling your house but want to know when is the best time? What month would give me the best bang for my buck? With the holiday season uh, right upon us, it seems like this is the great time to actually do some of that research and answer that question. So, how can we do it? How do we tackle it? Well, let's do some basic research online. The actual term, the best month, best month to sell to sell a house. And let's see what we come up with. Well, basically we find in most areas, the best time to sell a house is during the first two weeks of May. So early spring is, I believe that's more of a national thing, but let's see what we could find out. So I'm going to go into the multiple listing service of Long Island, and this is the Realtors Portal, also known as Stratus. And we're going to go to the report generator. We're going to type in a town. In this case, I'm going to do Syosset, which is a town on the North Shore of Long Island. We're going to keep the school districts open. Syosset can bleed into other school districts. Oh, I, I, oh no, there it is. Syosset, some, it does border some other towns, but most of the uh, houses in Syosset, school districts are in Syosset. They can go into Plainview and some other areas as well. I don't want to, I'm not going to be concerned right now with condos and co-ops. We're going to keep it just residential. We're going to keep it single family. And there is no waterfront. And then we're going to, instead of doing sold properties, and we're going to do transactions, we'll get back to the property type in a minute. But and we're going to generate the report. And let's see if we come up with May as the number. Let's read the chart down here. We see right here November 280 houses went actually uh, were pending or pending sale under contract. And then for May, which is what we just read, we have 271. So it's close. When would be the slowest time of the year? November of 2018. This is November of 2016. We have November of 2016. It seems to have been 280 houses uh, actually went on the contract. And in November of 2018, we have 242. So let's just keep it in 2018 and see when we have the most. Well, there you go. May. May is 255. Supply and demand, we know, is a large um is a large part of how much money you'll actually yield for any transaction. So you need to check out a video I made called uh, What is Absorption Rate? and find out what the competition was at that time. So absorption rate takes all those different indicators into uh, account and check out that video and it will give you more of an understanding of when is the best time to sell. Google seems to be pretty correct here, but the uh, 18 five days on the market is that specific to your town? You have to do more research to find out. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, thanks for joining us. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for uh, notifications in the future. This is Mark Schreier from Century 21 American Homes.